Yes, beautiful people, what's up? How's everyone doing? Two British nerds here. Hope everyone is literally well and of course doing well, whoever you are and of course wherever you are. So news broke a while ago that Marvel have officially confirmed that there will be an all new Ghost Rider show on Hula or Hulu, I can never pronounce that name, basically starring the man himself, Gabriel Luna for Marvel's Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. and his all new Ghost Rider um, TV show. They've also confirmed basically um, a Hellstorm series. So let me let me read you something I saw in the article. Um, it basically says Jeff Loeb mentioned that they had um, thought of three to four shows that would be part of Marvel's Adventures Interfere chunk chunk of programming on Hulu. So when I saw this news, basically that obviously Ghost Rider has been confirmed, Hellstorm has officially been confirmed. It got me thinking of a of a particular comic book um, arc within a Ghost Rider series called, I always forget, it's called Spirits of Vengeance, Rise of the Midnight Suns. So what the Midnight Suns are, and I'm reading that literally off Google, because I, I still haven't read his comic book. I've been, you know what, it's funny, I've always wanted to read it, but I never have, but I, I have to read it now. Like, So it says the Midnight Suns, a team of supernatural superheroes, including Hellstorm, Jennifer Kale, Morbius, Werewolf by Night, and Ghost Riders, Danny Kitch, and Johnny Blaze, the team first appeared in Ghost Rider issue 28, 1992. So it got me thinking basically that what Marvel actually are looking to do is actually give us basically the team, but possibly a different team with possibly different characters. We might see Man Thing, we might possibly even see Brother, Vo uh, Brother Voodoo, we might even see The Punisher. And the reason I'm, I'm, I'm assuming that Marvel are gonna go to, um, are going to go with this with this team or, or a particular team they're going to they're going to pick. I don't think they'll stick to the comics. Um, it's because we all know the Netflix shows that we all loved were cancelled, and that was Marvel's dark dark expression in regards to how they express their dark tone, their storytelling, and of course in Daredevil, Jessica Jones, Iron Fist, Luke Cage, The Punisher, and of course the Defenders. So that's been they've all been cancelled. But it looks like with the TV shows, they're, they they are. Put, put into production or they, they will announce soon is going to be Marvel's take on the Netflix shows as in giving us basically some really cool horror movies or horror TV shows that uh, potentially will replace those Netflix shows to a certain extent. See my personal thing on my personal take is even though the, these shows are cancelled I'm pretty sure they're going to bring all of the Netflix shows back eventually in accordance with what they want to bring out in regards to phase four, phase five and so forth. But overall, I'm really pumped and excited in regards to basically the Ghost Rider show, the Hellstorm. I'm pretty sure they're going to have the Midnight Suns. Um, it's going to be an amazing, dope story if they do it, if they do it right. And of course, if they do it dark and gritty, just like in the comic books, because we all know they are a very, very dark team. Um, literally, that's my thoughts on it. That's my take. That's my... I guess that was my state of mind when I basically obviously heard of Hellstorm being confirmed and um, of course, um, um, you know, we all knew that Robbie Ray's Gabriel Luna's Ghost Rider was actually getting, getting put into production. So I guess question of the day, are you excited about this, um, this announcement? What do you think basically the all new Ghost Rider show will open up in regards to new um, characters, new TV shows seeding from this Ghost Rider um, TV show? As always, love to know, love to know your thoughts, your comments, Drop all your comments down below. Smash that thumbs up button. Give this video um, a like, same thing. Um, basically, smash that YouTube subscribe button. Smash that YouTube bell button. And catch me literally on the tube. Otherwise known as YouTube, literally um, tomorrow. As always, peace out. Yeah.